Hi Al, just want to make this quick so maybe I could load it from my home. Just wanted to say thank you to everyone who's saying thank you to me for just giving you the information that I found that I think someone else found about um, Phyllis Stokes' pastor because people were questioning if it was really the real person, which, you know, I guess we all, we all got to do that on the internet, right? I mean, when you see people, you at least you see I'm a person, um, but I don't, you know, people question and I understand. I was questioning myself. So the pastor put up a video. I tried to look it up. It didn't work. People said they pressed on her picture. It didn't work that way for me. Someone else put a wrong last name spelling. So I, I finally found her. I'm just a go-between. I have a YouTube channel. I, um, you know, I like to pray for people. I like to help people because I've been through a lot in life. I had childhood cancer. And I have a disabled son. And, you know, I can't tell you all that goes through taking care of Polly. He is 15 years old. And, you know, maybe he doesn't want everything to be known about all his problems. But it brings me happiness when I see something, you know, especially as someone I watch. And I ask people to pray because my, my one prayer alone obviously isn't going to work. Because why would I have a child with cancer? Why would I have a disabled son, right? So... It just warms my heart that people appreciate the, it's just a little thing I did. I mean, not really little. It took forever to find the name of the pastor, but I did, and all I did was pass it on. So, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cry, but it means a lot that people appreciate because nowadays, especially what I went through with all the trolls, I don't understand people like that to say cruel things, especially to, to and about my child and out a video they did about Phyllis. I don't understand people like that, so I hope you all got it. I have a special video I wrote, Phyllis's name and the pastor's name. You could look it up, verify she's a pastor. Well, I guess it's all I could do. I can't do anymore. I'm not vouching that she is who she is. I'm just putting out there that she put herself out there, gave the address of the church and so on and so forth. Anyhow, it's enough before I just keep crying. So anyhow, I hope you all got up to the page, found the video, got the address to the church, and you can write to Phyllis and keep on praying. So don't forget to subscribe. All the other stuff I say, share, sharing is caring. Pay for it feels good in your heart, Polly's heart, my heart. And uh, thanks for getting us to almost 600 subscribers. Bye, everyone. Please continue to pray for Phyllis. Sorry about the water bottle. I just noticed it now.